to be made of the diving response, a key one will be the pressure on this band around her calf. When a blood pressure cuff around her thigh is inflated, it will prevent blood flowing out of her leg through the veins. Blood will still flow into her leg through the more deeply buried arteries. Standing at the surface. The pressure on the calf band, the lower line, slowly increases as blood flowing into her leg is trapped by the blood pressure cuff and her calf swells. When the cuff is released, the pressure falls as the blood escapes. But what will happen when Patrizia dives? At the equivalent of 40 meters down, she signals she's okay and the blood pressure cuff on her thigh is inflated. This time, the lower line stays flat, showing there's almost no blood being trapped in her leg. The only explanation is that little or none is entering. In fact, this is what's happening. One of the first things that occurs when humans or animals go underwater is that the arteries supplying the outer parts of the body, like legs about and to arms. be measured in now Enzo Mallorca, as he prepares for the deepest dive ever attempted at the Buffalo facility. Enzo has to compensate for the growing pressure on his eardrums by forcing... This is the second major feature of the diving response. As blood flow to the rest of the body is cut, demand on the heart is lessened. That means it can beat more slowly, reducing its own need for oxygen and reserving the diminishing stores for the most important organ of all, the brain.